In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a PCB footprint that is not standard, like this in this package symbol. The prints have different spacing. That is very simple and easy. Let's start doing that. Open up your PCB editor, click New. Write down the name of the PCB footprint, whatever you want to do that. I'm going to give the same name. S12S select package symbol wizard click OK I already have a PC footprint having the same name I'm going to operate that so here you can see the package symbol is very similar to single inline package what we are going to do is we are going to create a PC footprint that has six pins including a pin here in this empty space and we are going to delete the unnecessary pins later so load the template now click next everything is fine here click next we have six pins write down six here lead pace is the distance between two pins that is 100 mils or 2.54 millimeter we can see here write down 100 millimeter 100 mils here Package width is the width of the package that is 7.05 millimeter or 0.278 inches. In mils, it is 278 mils, and the package length is 19.65 millimeter or 0.774 inches, that is 774 mils. Write down the value here. Click next. We have to select a pad stack for the pins. If you look over here, you can see that the recommended hole diameter is 39 mils. You can design your own pad stack or you can choose a pad stack from the library. I'm going to select one pad stack from the existing library. Here I have a pad that has pad diameter 65 mils and hole diameter 49, 41 mils. That is very close to the recommended hole size, so I'm going to use this. Click OK. Now click Next. Next. And Finish. OK. Now we have to delete the unnecessary pins. To do that, select this Delete icon. We don't have pin number 3 here. Let's delete that. And we also don't need pin number 5 for this model. Right click and click done. Now another thing you can see here that the pins are not in the middle. The pins are in one side so we have to move this box. We can do that by selecting this move icon but before doing that we have to change the grid size. You can do that by going to setup, grids, change this grid spacing to 50 mils and this one also click OK. Now select this move icon and select this rectangular box and move this here. Do the same thing for all other rectangles. You don't need to know what these rectangles mean. Now we are done. Save the footprint. Here you go. We have created the PCB footprint. Thank you for watching this video.